slowly dying And my dear, we're still goodbye As long as you love me Happy February everyone and it's Friday so TGIF. Um, I wanted to pop on here and show you guys this dress. I posted it in blue yesterday. So in my photo yesterday I mentioned that I was really hesitant buying this dress so I wanted to pop on here and tell you guys why and also why I decided to buy it and why I love this dress. But first of all, can we just take this dress in because it is stunning. And like I mentioned, I um, posted it in blue yesterday. I loved it so much that I went ahead and bought it in red as well. So um, I mentioned that I wasn't sure if it was going to fit my body type. I am heavy chested on the top, but I have like a skinny waist. And normally I'm a size small, but it, sometimes it's hard to find um, dresses that are like form fitting and they hug me really well. And I don't tend to wear a lot of dresses that are like spaghetti straps um, because I can't really go braless. And so that was my main concern with this dress. But it is so pretty and I saw it on so many people that I really, really wanted it. I just decided to bite the bullet and buy it. And if I didn't like it, I was going to return it. Um, I read all the reviews and everyone suggested sizing up because it runs small. So normally I'm a small. This is a medium. So I'm so glad I bought it because this fits me really well. I do wear it without a bra and it fits me really nicely. It hugs me on the waist. Um, it allows room on top um, and it's just such a well-fitting dress. And here's the view from the back. Um, so yeah, as you can see, it is spaghetti strap and it has a zipper on top. Um, but it's just, it fits me so perfectly. And you can see the length. I'm 5'6 and it falls just above my ankles. I just have to move in closer because this lace applique part is just to die for. I mean, it is just so pretty. Um, there is like a shorter layer underneath. I'll just show you this right here. And then the lace. If you are on the fence about buying it, I strongly suggest you do because it is on sale right now, 40% off. And this dress comes in like 11 or 12 colors. Like there are so many color options. This dress is so perfect for Valentine's Day, for brunch, for a date night, for wedding. Like they actually have options. Um, I think the silver one is like a little bit shimmery, just perfect for a wedding. So I hope that helped um, and I hope the sizing helped. Again, size up one. Um, if you're small, get a medium. If you're medium, get large. Um, and you are going to absolutely love it. It is just such a darling dress. Good morning guys, I wanted to show you the overnight oats I made. I mentioned this I think yesterday or the day before actually, um, how I made my first overnight oats. I wanted to quickly pop on here and show you guys how I made it. If you guys have any recipes or any tips and tricks, let me know. Um, I do need mason jars because that's what you're supposed to make them in. Right now it's in a glad way. I use these Quaker oats. These are the quick one minute kind, which I think are perfect. Um, but if there's a special kind of oats I need to be using, please let me know. My sparkle filter has put hearts <laughs> on this dude here. Um, anyways, and then you can use almond milk or coconut milk. I got this silk coconut and almond mix. Um, I do love coconut milk a lot, but I figured the almond and coconut mix would be really yummy. And it is. It's a great blend. It's unsweetened. So I put the oats in here last night and I poured some of the milk in it. Um, and this morning it has turned into like a terrific consistency. Love the way it looks. And then I just got some chopped walnuts and I crushed them a little more and sprinkled them on top. And then just a little bit of honey, if you can see it. I'm going to slice the bananas and put it on there. I think adding fruit is such a good idea. I love the crunchiness from the walnuts and just a touch of sweetness from the honey. So yummy. Hey guys, it's been a long day and I am ready to wind down from this busy week with some wine. Friday nights are usually my movie nights. I think Friday nights are absolutely perfect for movie nights. I always have to pop some popcorn. I usually have champagne. Tonight I'm going with wine. And the wine I'm drinking tonight is Woodbridge by Robert Mondavi. One of my favorite, favorite wines. I absolutely love this wine so much. And if you notice, it's a mini bottle because it's single serving, which I think is the perfect size for one person. This way I don't have to open a whole bottle. Sometimes it goes fast, especially if it's red. I would love some movie suggestions. If you guys have seen anything lately that you absolutely love, um, please DM me and let me know. Uh, but first, I just want to show you guys what I'm wearing. 
I love this fleece. It's from Red Dress Boutique. I think they still have it in one size in the white, and then they have it in like an orange crush color and gray. And of course, I've got joggers on because what else? And I've linked some of my favorite ones for you guys to shop if you swipe up. And then these really cute love slippers are from the Ed by Ellen line. And I couldn't find the exact ones, but I will link similar ones. Okay, guys, I'm thinking either A Star is Born because I love Lady Gaga and Bradley Cooper. I've heard it's an excellent movie. Or I'm thinking First Man. This looks really good, too.